Hi guys, so again, I cannot stress enough how important it is to make sure that you have a lino print plan in your sketchbook where you have clearly mapped out your colours. As your original image is obviously a reverse for your tile, it needs to be clear where you're cutting out and so there's no confusion, that is why we have a lino print plan. So again, you can see here that I have already cut out the areas I am going to have white and I have started that printing process, as you will have seen before. The next area that I'm going to cut out is going to be my second lightest, which is going to be my yellow. Now, what I would recommend that you do is what I've started to do here and I am just marking it out in pencil. Now, you might not be able to see too clearly in this video, however, you will be able to see it obviously in person. So anywhere I know I can see that is a yellow or whichever colour you have chosen. Again, making sure obviously we have white, we have a light grey, we have a mid grey and then we have black. So I've went white, yellow, green and then my dark blue. So I know where I am going to be cutting out. And again, very same process. You can experiment with the different tools that you want to use. So if I have slightly bigger sections, what I may wish to do initially is to score my tile first and then cut out. I find it easiest to use the kind of deeper scoop. So I have a precise point, again, at all times making sure that your cutting hand kind of takes the lead. Your other hand should never be in front. That's obviously how we have some accidents. So again, make sure that your other hand, your non-cutting hand, is always in line with or away from your cutter and again you can see I'm doing this in small sections at a time you can be rotating your tile and take your time with where you are cutting out and as always with the cuttings please make sure that you don't wipe them off and onto the floor so again with my outline I just tend to kind of skim the surface initially so skimming the surface gradually and then I can work my way all around. So again, once you have done the outline, then that is when you can move on to doing your bigger section. You lined up with something like that where I'm going all the way through my kind of outline first and then I can start to cut away these bigger sections. Again, always going away from you. You can be rotating your tile if you need to then in the other direction. 